Hey guys, welcome to Paris Space YouTube channel. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to import and upload avatars by using Unity 3D. Before we get started, I need you to make sure you have exactly the same version of Unity as I do. Otherwise, we cannot assure you that our SDK will work properly on the other versions. The version we need to use today is 2021-36F1. You need to download Unity Hub and choose our recommended Unity versions on their official website. Scroll down to the bottom of their landing page. Click on Get Unity. Download Unity Hub in line with the type of your computer system. Visit the Download Archive and choose our Unity version. You will find the proper Unity version under the Unity 2021X folder. Please double check before following along. Step 1. Search for avatars online. There are many channels on the market for you to download Avatar's 3D resources. For example, a Japanese website called Boot is one of the biggest markets for selling and buying Avatars today. If you don't recognize Japanese, I would recommend another website called Unity Asset Store, which is an excellent place to start, because the resources you get here can be easily imported into Unity Project. When downloading and using third-party resources, Please pay attention to the license agreements and make sure you have the right to use them. Of course, you could create your own avatars by using tools such as 3D Max and Blender. But if you've never done this before, we suggest you just look for open source. There are many avatars free of charge. Here, I am using a free avatar resource that I downloaded from Booth for the following demonstration. Step 2. Create a new UAPI project in Unity and import Paraspace Avatar SDK. Open the Unity Hub and create a new project. Under the Create a New Project page, select version 2021, 36F1 and 3D UP a template. Because our product is URP based and it performs better by doing so. Go ahead and create this project now. It takes 5 to 10 minutes to load. It depends on your computer performance. Please be patient while the program is loading. After you create a new project, drag the Paraspace Avatar SDK Unity package you just downloaded from our official website into the folder called Assets. Click Import and await Unity processing the SDK package. After it finishes importing the Paraspace SDK, you will see three functional buttons and our SDK menu available on your Unity. And now you are free to download your avatar resource online. Step 3. Download and import 3D avatar resource. Open the free avatar resource I just found on Booth. Download and import this resource into the Unity project. Once it is done, you can find it in the Assets folder under the Unity project. If your avatar file is bought from the Unity store, you will see all your avatars here. Click the top menu window. Search for the package manager and your avatars will be saved in the assets folder. Once you have downloaded the avatar resource, import it to Unity and you are good to go to the next step. Step four, mount avatar root. Find your avatar file under assets. Drag this model into the Unity scene. Now we need to check if this avatar's animation type is humanoid. Check the component bar on the right. If you can see the animator panel appears on your component bar and the avatar parameter is filled by the avatar's humanoid bone, then it means the avatar you just imported into the Unity project is based on humanoid animation. Please note this. The Paraspace SDK package does not support uploading the non-humanoid models. Then, we need to mount a component called ParaAvatar root to the avatar resource. Here is the way. Click at component under the component bar and type avatar in the search bar. You will find para avatar root appears under the search results. Click it. Now we need to set the avatar's point of view under the para avatar root component. Place the camera right in front and middle of avatar's eyes. After that, you can publish the avatar. Step five, publish avatar. Click the Avatar Publish button in the upper right of the center area in Unity. Once you're done checking resources, then click the Upload button to enter the upload interface. Fill in the required information on the upload interface. 
then click the Upload button and finish the upload. The avatar needs to be packed before the uploading process starts. It takes a while, please be patient. After it's been successfully uploaded, we will process and optimize your avatar on the cloud to make sure it can achieve the best possible performance. The whole process takes about 5 to 10 minutes. When it's done, you will be able to find this avatar on this platform.